Hey, hey, this is Marlena from 123manifested.com. At the bottom of the screen, you will see that I have a brand new website and I'd love you to go visit it. Check it out and let me know what you think. I am building on to it, adding new things. And I'm really excited about today's episode. As you can see on the screen, it says, let's welcome change. And change is good, especially when it jingles in your pocket. <laughs> so we're going to talk really about the changes that may be taking place in your life or should be taking place in your life. What is stopping you from allowing that change um, to take place? Fear is usually the biggest stopper, the biggest blindfold that we put up in front of us and we are afraid of something different. We're afraid of, you know, making a sudden change, a move, a shift. Um, so that fear blocks us and stops us from having the brilliant uh, lifestyle that we deserve, that we are looking for, all right? We would love to experience that change, but we don't know what you know, is going to happen if we do change. All right. So many of you may have experienced something this year um, where you had to change. You may have had to move. And what a big change that is, right? It's exciting, but it's also scary uh, all at once. So you get a little nervous, you know, moving and wondering and packing and it's tiring, you know. Um, and it can be really excitingly exhausting at the same time. So when you're done, you know, getting to the new place and putting everything down and doing a little bit of stuff just so you can get the bed set up and, you know, maybe a cup or plate out and you're so tired that you just want to lay down and sleep and say, I'll get to it tomorrow, right? That's a change that ends up being good for you but it took you step by step to get there. It was a process. And, um, you know, you were probably, if it was something that suddenly happened because of a loss of job or something like that, it is anxiety, it's stress. Um, and, you know, you're just like, what are we gonna do now? And the fear blocks you. And um, sometimes you make a, you know, a wrong decision, all right? Um, so we don't want to do that. We don't want to react when we have fear, all right? We want to breathe. We want to take a walk. We want to relax um, and let it process first before we take any sudden action. So we don't make mistakes. Some of you may have um, lost your job and that's a shock. Uh, and that's a big change, right? So it goes from income to no income. That's a shock. And it's a fear, fear of the future. Um, you know, so all these changes are a similar kind of stress. Um, they bring about a big shift inside of you. And for some people, they can just say, that's fine. I'm going to, you know, start a new business. I'm going to go and get that other job I always wanted anyway. And they take immediate action, right? The landlord says, you're out of here. Um... You know, some people will sit there as long as they can and make the landlord fight and go to court and all that stuff instead of taking action and finding a way to either um, pay the rent and make it right or go to a place where they can really afford, right? Uh, these things happen. So you need to learn about change and change ends up being good if you do it the right way. All right, step by step. I know from working with thousands and thousands of clients that they um, sometimes will know it's coming, right? Like, I haven't paid my rent in three months. Now the landlord wants to kick me out. What do I do? And I go, what do you mean, what do you do? You knew. 
you know, four months, you knew something was going on. And, um, you know, for three months now, you haven't paid the rent. You didn't go to the landlord and say, this is what's going on. So you are afraid of facing the truth and that there's going to be a change and you're going to have to make a change. So you see how stagnant that can be in your life and what it does to you. It sabotages you, right? It brings you backward. It brings fear and shock and it freezes you, right? So some people just totally freeze up and run and hide. And the other group of people, they face it head on. And those are the ones that took action and their life changed. So that's why I want to say, let's welcome in the changes, whatever they are that you are facing right now, right? Some of you um, have decided to move, right? Some of you have decided to change a job. So you're excited, you're motivated, you're moving, you're doing things, right? And you're taking action for yourself, right? Even though there might be a little, you know, fear of moving to a new city or a new home, uh, making new friends, you know, things like that. A new job, you know, uh, will the people like me? And, you know, all that stuff is still there, but you're not afraid to take a chance, right? We have to take chances in life, all right? Um, or else you're just going to be like a robot, you know, and wishing and hoping and praying that something better will happen. So I'm bringing forth this video to waking you up, stir up that motivation in you today to get you to allow the change to come. Because whether you're a client of mine or not, okay, it doesn't matter. You're on this video for a reason, right? You either got invited or you clicked on it, all right? <clears throat> by, you know, a desire to see what's this about, right? <laughs> so I'm glad you came here because this is important for you and everyone on the planet is gonna go through changes. We have all been through the change this year, right? And next year, um, we are gonna have a different change, okay? So we have to go with the flow and allow it to happen, all right? Um, don't allow things to um, happen to you that you can help, okay? <clears throat> Such as you got a bill that needs to be paid, right? Electric bill or whatever that is. You know it's coming once a month. They're providing you with a service and that bill is going to come, right? So what you need to do is make a budget, okay? Okay. How much of your um, income, all right, is left over after you pay all your bills? If nothing's there, then what do we have to do to remedy that? We have to bring in more income, okay? There's no reason why you can't bring in more income in some way, either by selling things, okay, starting a business, getting a second job, whatever it takes. These motivated people become the ones, all right, who are millionaires and billionaires, all right? A millionaire and a billionaire doesn't watch television. I can tell you that from experience. There's no TV going on, okay? They get up in the morning, they're right on their business, right on their business, all right? In the shower and out the door. All right. If they have done their business at home, they're right on the uh, computer and they're going. They got their classes going. They got whatever's happening. Right. Um, they know <laughs> that it takes this kind of lifestyle. They go to bed early. They're up early. Right. Yeah. And that's what they do. They have businesses going, not just one, several. Right. They've got stock market going. They've got somebody else working for them right they know what to do they bought uh real estate they did something right they engaged in the process um they are you know giving a service right performing a service and getting paid well because they know what they're worth 
So a lot of people um, don't allow their self, all right, to have a good life. And it's sad. I want you to live your dash. The dash is the line that's on your gravestone in between the day you were born and the day you go. All right. That in between is important. All right. So what is your goal for next year? I want you to think about that. What is your goal? Have you set a goal? I mean, a goal for your life. I'm not talking about you want to lose weight or whatever, or you're going to stop eating chocolate or whatever. That's not what I'm talking about. I'm talking about what is your goal for you? All right. What kind of income? All right. Are you going to bring in? What are you going to do to get that income? All right. What steps are you going to take? What is your plan? Do you have a plan? Without a plan, you fail, right? And you never fail from trying. Like I said in another video, look at the Wright brothers, okay? People laughed at them, you know? You'll never get that up in the air. What are you doing? Well, they were making an airplane, right? And um, look at us today. We can go anywhere we want in the world, okay? Even with this thing going on, you can still fly, right? Um, so that's why I say, you know, two people can move a mountain, all right? And that's why I'm here, okay, as your backup guide for this video to motivate you, okay, to build that airplane. Now, right now, you have all the parts sitting inside of you, all right? They're all the parts, all the gifts, all the talents, all the ideas, all the inspiration, all the motivation, Okay, you were gifted that before you got here. You have a brain and it's still working. Okay, you have hands that are still moving, feet that still walk. Okay, um, you could be in a chair, all right, with wheels. And you can still move around, all right. You can still talk, you can still help people, all right, in one capacity or another, all right. <clears throat> so this is what I'm saying. Take all them tools and think about it. What can I do? All right, what I really enjoy to increase, right, my income. What can I do to bring in this change that I am really looking forward to? So that's where you're at today. Today's question for you is, what's inside of you <laughs> that needs to come out for the world? We're waiting for you. <laughs> the world has need of you. Somebody out there is looking for your services, all right? If you need some help, support, you got questions, I want you to contact me. Go underneath the video, all right? All the information is in the description box. Click on show more. Everything will be right there for you, all right? Subscribe to the channel, all right? Click the little bell icon with the A-L-L, -L, all right? And... Keep an eye on this channel. Watch the other videos. There's very important videos here for your life, all right? They will inspire you. They will train you up. They will teach you something. They'll make you laugh, all right? I am here to motivate you, all right? I am your dream life activator. That's why I'm here. That's why you're here, because you have a dream inside of you that wants to come alive. Are you ready for change? Would you really like to see a change in your life? This is where it begins. It begins right now, right here, right now. I know without a doubt that something in this video moved you, right? It moved your emotions. It just went, whoops, okay. And it made you think, all right? Because I was brought to that place too where it made me think, what are you going to do now that this happened to you, all right? And I had to take action, all right? And I've done it. I've been there, okay? And I'm still going, all right? I am not giving up and I'm not giving in, okay? I'm going to keep going even when things say you can't go, 
And this is why there's always some voice trying to stop us. Right? And I said, silence. You're not my voice. I am moving forward. Okay? Now, I am in a home right now that I bought sight unseen. Okay? By asking and manifesting it. Okay? Mm. So you can do the same thing. It's going to take a desire. You have to have a desire for change. Something inside of you wants a change. I got to ask you, what is stopping you? Mm. Think about that. That's why I give you a moment of silence. Why do you let it stop you any longer than right now? Do you have a piece of paper and a pen? If not, go get one. Okay, at the $1 store. Everything's a dollar. All right? So you can get a notebook and a pen for $2. Okay? Or even more cheaper than that somewhere. And that's fine. I want you to write down your goals, your dreams. All right? And write down what steps you're going to take to get there. All right? It's very easy. Okay? One step at a time. And as you work through those goals, check them off, right? If your income is not enough to pay those bills, what are you going to do about it? All right. If you're not going to work a different job, an extra job or start a business and your income is going to sit at that amount, but you can't afford the rent and the electric and the car and the cable, what are you going to do? All right, because it's going to come. All right, but you have the solution in your hands. There's no need to panic anymore. It's good to welcome that change in. All right, are you willing to deal with that thing head on right now? Because it's going to come, it's going to show up where the bill is going to show up, and you're going to have to submit the payment. Right? So that's why I'm here today. I want to get you back on your feet or on your feet, depending on what is going on in your life right now. Because every one of us has gone through some changes, right? Or you may be married to someone who is going through changes and they are taking you with them, okay? Because you're married to them. So you need to back each other up, right? When they're down, you have to stay inspired, all right? Yeah. And sometimes there's no one there to encourage you, such as my case. So I encourage myself and I keep going and going and going and going, all right? And believe me, I've had more than my share of letdowns and disappointments and people, you know, harassing and turning on me. And I just chose to love them and move on and keep going with my dream, not theirs, mine, okay? This is your life, not mine, yours. And I would love you to experience the greatest life ever. Let them be jealous. Let them complain. Let them say what they want. Some people we must walk away from. Shut the door in yesterday's space. Okay? We're in a very new day, a very new moment right now. This is the moment where you make a choice. And I'm going to ask you, are you willing to take a chance today for your own life? Make a choice to welcome in a change, a better change. No matter what it takes, no matter what you're going to face, no matter what you're going to have to deal with, take it head on and end it, right? Finish it. I'm going to tell you right now, if the bill collector is coming with a bill and they're going to give you a late fee and you know it's coming, isn't it better to call them before they come after you? 
all right? And tell them, this is what's going on. We're going to have to make a payment plan, whatever, okay? Or shut off the cable, get rid of that expensive phone, you know, sell some stuff, do something, all right? Instead of um, sitting there crying, complaining, uh, some people drink, you know, or drug it up or eat it up or whatever, instead of dealing with it and welcoming something better, something new. So sometimes when one door closes, all right, not too long after something new happens and it's a better door, right? Mm, a better situation. So this is what we're going to deal with today. We're going to deal with welcoming the change, whatever it takes for you. <laughs> I am sending that to you right now, whatever it takes for you to allow the change to happen in your life. Let it happen now. Let that inspiration, motivation, the drive, the courage to welcome the change starting today. And that's the intention that I'm setting for you. Remember, you are the one who's living the dash. Right? Mm. So in the end, you'll have no regrets. You'll be a happy, grateful person. So thank you so much for viewing this video. Check out the other videos and please check out the new website as I am building it. I would love to have some input here how this video has spoken with you. All right. It may have hit you hard, right? Because I know when we face something, it's going to hit us hard. And sometimes we need to hear it, you know, coming from somebody else to motivate us, to get us going, to inspire us, to give us some direction. I'm not picking on you, right? I've been picked on, all right? And it's time to stop that. It's time to just go forward. Who cares what they say or do or not do? It has nothing to do with me, right? It's not my business. This is my business right here to support you in your journey. Have an awesome day. I know you're going to. Thank you so much. Take care.